Jarmax Ooze Uzi. No, not a gun. It's Jarmax Ooze, our next event. No CPV, PPV, whatever you want to call it. Just announced. It's a P. Shut up. Triple, P shut up. Triple threat match, number one contender, Dracon, Edge, Pac-Man. Winner gets a world title shot at the All-American. That was Edge, Pac-Man. American Band. Fatal four-way for the hardcore title, Mongo McMichael. Kalen Rogers, if he's still alive. Matt Icorn and Steven Spryder. This is going to be elimination style, folks. It's going to be for the European title. Versus Mr. T. -T. No, I guess that's Lamb around McDaniel. All right, then. Danny Jackpot versus Grover Cleveland for the international title. If Danny loses, he quits Jeremax forever. That is the man! Our main event. David A-List Otunga puts his title on the line against that random nobody, Winter Bradley. I assume there's going to be more matches, so stay tuned. But that's all we got right now for Jared Max Ooze. If that's not enough to make you want to watch it, then you're stupid. I will take an Uzi to my face if I have to listen to you left. God. Anyway, our main event, tag team titles on the line. The Hardys and the Hogan's bitches. Why does a girl have to fight? Uh, she doesn't want to fight. Did you not listen to her when she was backstage? She... I did. She doesn't want to fight, but she has to. No, she... Hogan says he's not going to tag her in. And Hogan's word is gold, so you know he's not going to tag her in. Even though Hogan wants to... He's evil! He does want to take over. So I guess... Oh, and then again, so does Lam and He's done more than Hogan has tonight. Here's... At Artie. Matt Hardy. Matt Hardy. Oh, wow, that's original. Are you just coming up with that now? Yeah. And here comes his brother Jeff returning from being killed by Frollo last season. How did he revive from dying? Because Frollo can. Oh, God revived them all. Turned them. Good guys. It's... Frollo trying to redeem himself it's... by getting rid of Hulk Hope. Who it's turned on him? Beth Hardy. I think he's dating a chicken again. Oh, here we go. The Tag Team Champions. They shouldn't even be Tag Champions. Hogan forced the Nasties to lay down for him. Just because he wanted a belt. But that's ultimately saved him from Frollo right now. If he loses the belt, he's got nowhere to run. Frollo's coming out. So, I hope personally that the Hardys do defeat the Hogan's tonight. I don't. Why? So, I cannot die? Are you kidding? If Frollo can get rid of Hogan, you'll never die. Even though the oh yeah, baby! The prophecy, I guess, is still intact. If Hogan can make those three guys bleed, we're all dead, but I don't think he cares anymore. Here comes a Brooke Hogan, girlfriend of Doris Lickleton, who's currently on strike with the rest of Vertex. And here we go. Dorf is not awesome. Brooke was saying earlier she might as well have just gone with Vertex, because she doesn't want to fight the Hardys, so this is essentially a handicap match. Exactly. And we're going to kick things off with Matt Hardy against Hulk Hogan. So stupid. You're stupid. You're stupid! I'm not stupid. Yeah. Hogan with a big boot, Matt Hardy blocks it. And now he's just trying to choke him. And nice what move. a move! I hope it's over, not even a one count. Hogan's slow to get up. He's got a long match ahead of him. He, he doesn't want to tag in his daughter, Brooke. Daughter? Yes. Daughter? Yes. Daughter! Yeah. Daughter? Yes. Whatever. Brooke Hogan is Hulk Hogan's daughter. Outside of the ring, and Jeff Hardy takes what? the skew. Watch out, watch out, whoa! Oh, miss there. Brooke was gonna go after Matt, rethunk that one. And we missed the part where Jeff Hardy missed. Well, I didn't. Or you didn't. And then I saw her can run off the top rope by Jeff. Not the legal man, that's cheating. No, it ain't. It's very much cheap. There's no ref in here! The ref is right there, you just can't see him. Nice Sloopex there by Hulk Hogan. It's not Sloopex. It's Sloopex. It can be whatever I want. Nope. I'm Steve the Intern. You're fired! You can't fire me. I'm an intern. I'm getting paid, though. So Sakura. I'm getting laid and back to the action. Sakura, please fire him. Bro Brooke Hogan. Whatever, bye. Okay, Sakura isn't going to fire Oh, come on, that Hardy's pulling the hair. I know Sakura isn't going to fire Shocking. I know the Hardys want to win, but pulling Hogan's hair, that is just a big no-no. 
<laughs> it's actually yes, yes. Don't even touch my head. <laughs> and just like his brother, her can run off the top by Matt Hardy. Or uh, Fat Hardy, as you like to call him. Because <laughs> that's the most original thing ever. Wait, is Hogan going to go tagging Brooke? He's hiding behind her. And she, oh, she's going to distract him with her body. <laughs> Look at it. Brooke, she's getting involved. She didn't want Okay, I guess not. <laughs> Irish Whip. Irish Whip, the only move you're going to see Brooke Hogan do tonight. And now Hogan coming after Jeff. Former Jeremax Intercontinental Champion himself. Hogan is a two-time tag champion, a former world champion as well. That is awesome. You want Hogan... No, I mean former. No, well, that means he's lost that many times as well, so he's not that awesome. And he's also trying to take over Jeremax, and we don't want that. Yeah, we don't. Oh, nice back body drop by Hogan, and a leg drop to the arm. Oh, boy. Hogan now with a swoop. Oh, my God, swooping swooper. That was close. That was actually a swinging Nick Breaker. Nick <laughs> Breaker? Yeah. And, oh, no, 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 goes Hogan. Is that enough? One! Hogan's surviving pretty well without his daughter's help, except that one Irish whip. Look at Brooke just taunt on the apron. Oh, blocks that well, Brooke just goes up. Oh, knee to the penis. That hurts. Oh, yeah, and the ZPP guy. Anyway, ignoring that, in comes Matt Hardy. And Stop ignoring me. Brooke Hogan trying to distract him with her body once again, and a slupex there by Hulk Hogan. Stop calling it a slupex. Fine, I'll call it what it's supposed to be, a juplex. No! It's suplex! Fine, it's a suplex. It's not suplex. Big boot by Hogan. Yeah. Matt Hardy now in control, and a swinging neck breaker right there. What is a neck breaker? It's like a mint, except it's always fresh. Anyway, stop plugging our sponsors there. Matt Hardy blocking Hogan takes control off the top rope. Or the oh my God! I don't even get him. He wasn't time. going off the top rope. Not sure why I said that, but Matt Hardy in control of yeah, Hogan. Yeah, you're stupid. Shut up, man. I'm an intern. Just an intern. What an intern? Matt Hardy in control of Hogan. What's an intern? You'll learn when you're older. Hogan can't do this by himself, and he tags in Brooke even though he said he wasn't going to. And Brooke is hesitant to get in the ring. Mm -mm -mm. And now she's being counted out. A count out victory, though, and the Hogans still have the titles. So maybe this is smart. Maybe that's what Hogan was planning when he tagged her in. Matt Hardy was going to go after her, and she just runs away like a girl. <laughs> Standing moonsault by Jeff Hardy. Brooke really rethought that. Oh, look at that! Trips out. She's gonna fight. Gotta give her that. She's gonna... She Who's blinking the screen? She obviously thinks she can take Matt Hardy. Obviously. She tried to knock him down, but he's apparently too fat. <laughs> and now she's going back outside the ring. Because he's not Is this fight. the smartest thing she can do, or is she a coward? Why does Jeff Hardy have the stairs? <laughs> Hell is just breaking loose here, buddy, in the main event of war. Uh, Hardy's working he's on back Hogan. Away! Brooke Hogan has clearly had enough of this. And I don't blame her. Hogan said he wouldn't tag her in, and he tagged her in. Maybe this is just a master plan, and Hogan wanted her to get counted out. Regardless, the winners of the match are the Hardys, but still tag team champions are the Hogans. They have failed their mission. And I. Now they're leaving. Oh, wait, it's Dakota. Let's hear what he has to say. They did. Maybe. Hogan did think he could just run away. Oh, oh man, we're going to have a tag title defense at Ooze now, too. Wow. That's amazing. Oh, it's going to be a ladder match. <laughs> a tag team ladder it's match. It's a hardy specialty. It is. Tag team ladder match for the tag team titles, and now Hogan's complaining that Frollo doesn't Why does he have to keep fighting, he says? I have not forgot what Frollo tried to do to Jeremy, so I'm kind of on Hogan's side. Why is Frollo... Oh, hold on. Apparently, it's going to be Frollo versus the Nasties at Ooze in a handicap match, and Frollo asked for this. Oh, no. And next week, Hogan has to be in a handicap match against the Hardys. I'm Vortex nowhere to run for Hogan. He doesn't have Brooke to bail him out. 
on Vortex, it's going to be Hogan against the Hardys in a handicap match. And that's true, Hogan did say he could take them on. What a great main event we got planned next week. Hogan versus the Hardys in a handicap match last night for Ooze. This is Steve the Intern. Blee, blee, blee the blee. We are oh, no. back. Happy May 19th, everybody. Jeremax is back. We hope you keep watching. It can only get better from here. Stay tuned. Stay fresh, bitches. Oh, we still got time. Let's say something. Say yeah. something. Hi! Bye. Bye-bye. Can the video end? <laughs> Not yet. Okay, now. <laughs>